Domark's lineup of new releases at CES included a traditional simulation with a new twist, a different sort of simulation, and a pair of adventure titles. Tank Commander, a new tank simulation, is the first Domark game to include multiplayer options. The game will support Serial Link, Modem Link, and IPX networks. Tank Commander features four different tanks, the Abrams, Leopard, T-72, and Challenger, which will roam over nine extensive maps while completing 40 missions. Tank Commander's graphics package includes texture mapping, Gorod shading, and full motion video. In addition to your tanks, you're also in control of all your support vehicles, including Jeeps, Microlights, motorbikes, other tank platoons, and reconnaissance aircraft. Domark is billing Absolute Zero as its first Psy Sim ever. The CD-ROM title, which will be released simultaneously for the PC and Power Mac platforms, is set in the late 24th century in a mining colony on an icy planet that serves as a major refueling depot for Earth. A hostile alien race erupts from the core of the planet and kills one-third of the population, setting the stage for the battle for control of the planet. In a unique storyline, Absolute Zero allows the player to fight for either the colonists or the extraterrestrials. The game includes 12 different vehicles and Super VGA texture mapped objects. Domark's newest adventure title will be The Orion Conspiracy, a CD-ROM murder mystery set in a futuristic environment ruled by mega corporations. The player is stationed on a research station in outer space, where information regarding a recent murder is extremely scarce. The Orion Conspiracy will feature character speech, rendered full motion action sequences, and hand-painted backdrops in SVGA. And after a series of delays, Domark's much ballyhooed Lords of Midnight may finally be in stores as you view this episode of IE. Created by Mike Singleton, Lords will allow the player to control up to 24 different characters and will include 3D landscapes and SGI-rendered intros and outros. The game also has course plotting, a point-and-click interface, and an illustrated online almanac of all the characters and creatures that appear in Lords.